I, I have to unlock it first, don't I? Oh no. I think this is how you unlock it. Ooh, very pretty. Maybe pretty is the wrong word. What does it want me to do? It's chanting at me. Let me just go in, go it, go down. Oh, I go down. Sudden blades. What are we dealing with? <laughs> Look, I'm gonna be honest. This looks much sillier than the good campaign already. Um, right. So double shield, double shield people. Uh, these guys look kind of cool, although <laughs> this is not that flattering, I think. I have no idea, like, mole hens? Yeah, mole hens. Sort of Viking weirdos. <laughs> Speaking of, like, the Lord of the Rings things, this looks a little bit like Mouth of Sauron guy. <laughs> okay, I like this map a lot, by the way. This is extremely cool. We'll just see what happens. You know what? Berserkers are never a bad choice. So, like, a line of berserkers, and then, what else? Some muskets or something like that? Demon statue? The one wrapped in chains? I'm assuming this is some sort of secret behind it? Oh, I understand. The infernal whip. I like that a lot. You know what? Spear throwers. They're cheap and they do a lot of damage. These are shadow walkers. They turn into shadows and rise from your shadow to stab you in the back? Oh, I see. Yes, they, they rise from the shadows. I understand. They seem like a pretty hard counter to berserkers then, don't they? And spears. Right, that was horrible. I think I need things that fly in that case. New campaign, this was added two weeks ago. Look, in the world offline, this is new. <laughs> if I was, if I looked, if I walked outside my house right now and uh, there was a building that had been built two weeks ago, I would say that was a new building. It's all relative. Elves? I don't think I can, oh, you mean present elves. <laughs> Bro Valkyries, I guess? Like I said, flying units, maybe Valkyries. Okay, these guys are going to teleport in, but they're not going to get any purchase and they're just going to fall on the ground. Okay, I think I found the counter to them then, is Valkyries. How are the Valkyries going to tackle whatever these spiky idiots are? <laughs> what are you even doing? It's hard to even tell. They're holding their own pretty well. I think we've won. I didn't get the greatest idea of what was even going on, I think. We, we did something. <laughs> Searing vacuum. Okay, so it's more of these guys. More of the spiky heads. You look very cool, but you're very frightening. And then more of these guys who I still haven't worked out, so we'll we'll see. It it kind of looks like... I like the morning star, by the way. It kind of looks like these guys were just going to hit really hard. Well, immediately, my first instinct is to just go with what we know and do Valkyries. But I don't want to just place Valkyries, and I want to place them a bit high up. Maybe a Jarl, then, in the middle. I want to get a good idea of what these guys do. Oh, that's what they do. Oh, dear. That's... Look, I'm not even 100% sure what that did, but... It looked ex extremely impressive. Okay, I think we've won. Maybe? What are you... It sounds like a hoover is running in my ears. Okay, well, we've done it. I love his little eyes. I never noticed that the, the, the bear helmet that the Jarl wears has actual eyes before. Scorching Void. Oh, well, here's the whips. These are infernal whips. And then these shadow boys. Okay, so the shadow boys do frighten me because the shadow boys will jump up behind my shadow, as the name implies. Yes, lots and lots of shadow boys. Okay, I don't know how to handle the shadow boys. These whips, I would assume they're kind of like mid-range high damage. I guess they locked me down in a prison or something like that? Like some sort of infernal hell? You know what? Maybe just a big tanky unit can take out everything and I don't have to worry about it. Some peasants to distract the, the other guys? My plan has immediately gone wrong. Although, maybe it's gone a bit right. How are these peasants doing? Okay, peasants are dead. I'm hoping they can only do that jump into shadow thing once. Okay, he's evaded the infernal prison that they're gonna put down. Oh, I think we're dead. <laughs> they just burned him to death. Oh, you poor man. Oh, he looks bad. Oh, the necromancer? The necromancer could be good. Oh, the cupids could also be extremely good. Oh, it says I can use the, ex the, inter the infernal whips and the solar architects. Ooh, maybe that's an idea then. Maybe I have whip of my own. A cheerleader on my whip? I don't know. Let's see. How quickly is this necromancer going to be absolutely obliterated? Uh, pretty quickly. <laughs> oh, this guy's up still though. I don't think this is going to work. He can take out all these guys pretty easily, it turns out. But going to be hard pressed to take out all of these guys, I think. Okay, so I I'm guessing these are a bit like the pharaohs, where they make us, you know, tied to the ground almost. Elves can't be the answer. <laughs> like, I don't believe that the that the devs have ever made a map where elves were like the intended way of doing it. A single samurai. Nothing. A, a shield man. <laughs> this is gonna go badly for everyone, I think, because we've killed, I think, 
precisely one person. Give them guards. The elves are fun. They are fun. But they're not good, are they? You know what? I was hovering over the spooky units, and I, I've just realized why. Vampires sound like a magnificent idea. Okay, everyone's dead. Cool. It didn't work. Yeah, I think the vampires might do this. I mean, they're not going to do it on this occasion. On this occasion, they're all going to burn to death. Yeah. A lot of vampires, and then, I don't know, two halflings at the back just chilling out. They do not look like they're going to be well equipped to deal with this, but maybe. Oh, no. Oh. I feel bad about even putting them there now. Fly in, please. Take out these guys quickly so they can't do your their weird little thing. Oh, no. They look creepy. Like, something about the gestures puts me on edge. They're a bit like Cicero from Skyrim. Just imagine just a weird, creepy man just kind of kicking you with knives. I just don't like it. Yeah, I think we're dead again. I don't think we can win this. Either we're good against these guys or we're good against these guys. There is no in-between, I think. The Reaper will immediately kill everyone here, right? Like, not much these guys can do about it. Like, a Reaper against all these guys just seems like a bad thing, right? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely obliterated. Where are the present elves? Present elves are here, right? Oh, I've just remembered clams are in the game. No, that didn't work at all. That that was actually terrible. How does everybody else do this? This seems genuinely really difficult. Okay, this is the best chance we've had so far, I think. Oh my god, we actually have people alive at the end of that little bout. One raptor to take out these guys? No. That was the closest we came, though. If we get barrel riders back here, the assassins, whatever we're calling them, they'll teleport to these guys and instantly all explode. And then just raptors here at the front? These guys are going to get absolutely obliterated. And then the raptors are going to come in. No. Hmm. Oh, this is actually way harder so far. <laughs> Maybe we will win. If the barrel roller comes in and explodes. Can I get them? No. Oh god, we just have one ninja left and they have shields. No, it's not gonna work. We got a safe thrower. We got nothing. We got absolutely nothing. I can't use the- I can't use peasant elves. What's happening? Why have they formed one of those, like, rat knots that you see in sewers? Why are they dying? They're stuck and they're trampling each other? Yeah, it's just a big old group hug. Two or three clams. Maybe with uh, an, intern an infernal whip of our own. And then just stuff to keep them distracted, like peasants. Already, this is going all right. God, the clams have been nerfed so badly. I hate it. The fact that the clams aren't firing out just an endless torrent of nonsense at these guys d depresses me. Come on, clam, please. You have to back away. You cannot do this. Come on, clams. Clams, no. Clams, you can do it. Clams. Clams, you need to run. You have to run now. Come on. Oh my god. The ballista I'm gonna need to take control of immediately. Nope, that's the wrong thing. Uh, you need to turn- Nope, that's the wrong thing as well. Oh my god, it won't let me take control of the ballista. Okay. Come on, just take him out, please. There we go. Now you can take out these guys, maybe? Just distract them long enough that I can take them out. Come on, Clams. One more guy. Oh god, no, there's more! There's more! No, it was so close. No, it was going so well. <sighs> That's actually genuinely devastated me. Hopefully, like, right this second. Oh my god, it, it missed. Well, that's probably doomed us. And I missed again. Well, yeah, we're doomed. Nothing's gonna work. Immediately, he's gonna die, I think. Unfortunately. That was unlucky. Okay, I think they need to be in the middle, then. Oh god. <laughs> what am I doing? A pharaoh? You know what? A pharaoh might work. They're immediately dead. Although, maybe it works. They're bowing. Can the Choco Nu take out these guys? I don't know if we can win this. We've been on the same map for about 20 minutes. You know what? Maybe just like a giant. If I could get a skeleton giant going, maybe, and then an infernal whip behind him. Yeah, because they're all running now. That's, that's, that's the ticket, I think. Oh, they're not running for long, are they? Fear and a big old sword might be enough. This might work. We might actually be able to finish this map. The fact that they're getting frightened is great. And the fact that he just fell off the cliff is fantastic as well. You cannot die. If you die, this is a disaster for us. Oh my god. Oh... I've leaned fully back in my chair, <laughs> so the audio is probably a bit different now. The relief that I felt in my heart when that victory screen just popped up.